But let's start with the news today out of Miami and the problems for the Dolphins, Stephen Ross and his colleagues that run the Dolphins, some of his partners like Beal that were involved in this mess. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, for, okay, so we know we, we know that the Dolphins are going to lose two draft picks, right? Violation of tampering policy, the anti-tampering policy, and also the integrity of the game. And I could tell you from my first time I ever reported on any of these things was, gosh, when uh, in terms of integrity of the game, I, I had a tampering scoop when I worked for Fox that the uh, the Lions tampered with the Chiefs, and that was a minor tampering charge. They, they lost a late-round pick. But this is really serious, for real. When you look at this situation, Stephen Ross, go back to 2011, when behind Tony Sperano's back, he interviewed Jim Harbaugh, the, the then Stanford head coach, didn't tell Sperano, was still under contract, and, and interviewed in an airplane hangar in the San Francisco area, the, the Palo, uh, Palo Alto area, and he interviewed Harbaugh behind Sperano's back. So you know he, he he's going to do sneaky stuff. Then Ross tampered when Brady was still a quarterback with the Patriots, a team that in his division, okay, in his division that the NFL found in their six-month investigation. And then he also, and by the way, the same agent, Don Yee, you, you can't get in any trouble. He's allowed to do what he wants, but also did it again. And also with Sean Payton back in January, he talked to Don Yee or his inter inter inter, 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 inter intermediary did uh who works for the dolphins and this is the problem as you were alluding to it's people work for him in, in the back channel talks and also just doing it uh right there out in the open and the problem is the league knew for years that there was a connection because of the, the michigan connection ross and brady michigan alums right and now you you have this out there and they had to do something and they nailed him for it two draft picks now he's getting fined. He can't be around the team for a series of months. But there was a six-month investigation done on this. And there had been rumors about Ross trying to get Brady in there. It could have been as a player, as a quarterback still, if he wanted to play, as a minority owner. And the, the league nailed him on this stuff. And you do wonder, though, because remember now, Brady's going to be a broadcaster when he's done uh, with Fox. But the fact of the matter is, this has been going on behind back channels and the, the league found out about it and, and nailed him for it. 